Pushkin tem a novo disco acabadinho de sair e estão também a fazer uma digressão pela Europa. Aproveitaram e passaram por Portugal para um concerto no Coliseu dos Recreios, completamente esgotado, onde apresentaram Perfect Symmetry. So hi, welcome again to Portugal. You have been here a few times. Now you are here to present your third album, uh, Perfect Symmetry. Tell us about it. Well, it's an album that we're incredibly proud of. Um, we had a lot of fun making it, and I think it's the, the best thing that we've we've done yet. You know, I think you know, every probably every band who ever has a, a new record out probably wants to say the same things. But I think three albums in, we really feel. Um, We just know what we're doing and we're very excited. You decided to self-produce self the album. Why? Well, we last about this time last year, uh, or maybe a little while longer ago than that, we, we got asked to do a cover of a song for, for Radio One, um, Under Pressure. We were in America at the time and we recorded a song in a studio, um, just the three of us, and we really enjoyed doing it. Just, Being a gang, you know, three of us making this this recording. So it got to January this year, and we got an engineer on board. But basically, we went into a studio in Paris and, and then Berlin, and, and we, were, we sort of shut ourselves away. And we kind of thought, well, we'll at some point we'll run out of, of ideas, and we'll need to get some fancy producer in the makings of a record. And then we took it to Spike Stent, who he's mixed our last two albums, and he said. It sounds like a record, you know, you guys have done great. Why Berlin is so special for Kim? There's, there are lots and lots of reasons. Um, when we were in England deciding where we wanted to record the album, we thought we wanted to get out of England. Uh, again, just because we were enjoying that sense of being a gang and being away from everything. But we didn't want to fly anywhere, so um, we took the train to Paris to start with, and then we discovered that it goes from Paris across to, to Berlin. And so we thought, you know, Berlin's just got such a great reputation for being a, a cultural city and you know it's very modern and colorful and lots of great records have been made there what do you mean with the levels are losing well i think it's a it's a theme that runs kind of the whole way through the record um which is why it was a kind of good choice as a, i think as a single the song itself is about you know that sense of feeling like people who just believe in love and peace and good things seem to be losing the, the battle at the moment. Next step will be perfect symmetry, right? Yeah, absolutely. You know, and perfect symmetry is is weird because that song is is a, is exactly about war. You know, it's about people blowing themselves up in the name of religion or or, or you know territory or whatever it might be. Uh, can you tease us a little bit about the concert? So now we're you know we're playing for an hour and a half and there's just such great variety of different songs so it's nice to you know come to to portugal and, and to we feel have the perfect set list and a uh, great set of songs to choose from a great crowd to play to um, we've got lots of lovely production ideas and it, you know this venue is big enough to be able to you know, use all of those ideas that we've got so um, there'll be lots of lights and uh, you know visuals and all sorts of stuff which will be great Depois do concerto ainda acompanhámos o Skin até ao Hard Rock Café aqui em Lisboa, pois os rapazes tinham uma doação a fazer. Um dos seus pares de sapatos preferidos vão ficar a fazer parte do espólio do Hard Rock Café.